New at 5, a landfill fire in Ponca City has thick black smoke billowing into the air. What started Saturday is quickly becoming a nightmare for the city. Eyewitness News 5 reporter Jerry Strickland joins us now live from Ponca City. And Jerry, how did this fire start in the first place? Well, Susan, here in rural Oklahoma, it's not unusual for folks to burn their trash in a barrel, then bring it here to a landfill. Unfortunately, though, on Saturday, the winds were 40 miles an hour. Some of those hot embers actually traveled over here into this huge, huge pile of tire chips. Five days later, it is still burning out of control. The result probably going to be just let it burn out. Uh, tires, rubber, it burns and you can't hardly put it out with water. Training coordinator Gary Reed says because the tire chips are stacked up a foot and a half deep, oxygen just continues to feed the flames despite their work. Though it is contained for now, three acres of this landfill are still smoldering. You're watching KOCO TV 5, Oklahoma City. Now, live, local, late breaking. This is Eyewitness News 5 tonight. Three acres of tires continue to burn. We'll tell you what's being done to put it out. Eyewitness News 5 tonight starts right now. New details tonight that a special chemical might be helping in the fight against a landfill fire in Ponca City. Three acres of tire chips have been burning since Saturday. An Oklahoma City company called EnviroClean Services came up with a way to get the fire under control. But tonight there's a new concern that a very expensive landfill liner might be damaged by the fire. Very costly. Um, it's really hard to determine right now what the cost is, but um, if we get out of here for uh, less than 100000 I'll be real happy. Just move it around and get a lot of good agitation with it, kind of like, uh, like stirring your coffee. The fire apparently was started by someone who threw burning trash on the chips. Firefighters hope to use the chemical to spray the rest of the tire chips tomorrow. This is...